change my oil with Brandon's dear old dad. A helper. I'm just helping. I'm helping Jess. First things first, gotta drain the snake. That's what she said. <laughs> Find the lug nut thing underneath the car, use something to unscrew it, and make sure you've got something else like a funnel or a giant tube thing to catch all that dirty, dirty oil. Always glove up. Obviously, you don't need a car lift for this part, but it looks cool going up. That's what she said. And coming down. <laughs> and it was pretty, pretty, pretty fun to pull that lever. Wow. Now for the coup d'etat. Once you've got all that oil drained out, it's time to grab another funnel. Funnel it! Funnel it! And pour your vehicle grade oil in. Here we go. Here it comes. Drink up, little lady. She's thirsty. She's so thirsty. The Mini Cooper Countryman. All four S takes 4.4 quarts of oil, baby. Now that that's done, it's time to swap out the oil filter. And wow, we had a hell of a time trying to find that hole. That's what she said. <clears throat> so we looked and we looked, and eventually we pulled up YouTube and found out in less than a minute what we had to do. We had to unscrew and dismantle the antifreeze reservoir then, nestled far and underneath and to the side was that filter hose hole that we were looking for. That's what she said. We found the oil filter, and it's beneath some type of reservoir. It's way down in there. Those minis don't want you messing with their stuff. Oh my god. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Crazy. Are you afraid of getting dirty like your son? <laughs> you ever teach Brandon how to do any of this? I I showed him. I don't think he really was interested. That sounds like him. No ball, no thanks. We found it, we swapped it, and boom. All right, Grandpa Greg has completed the oil filter, the oil, and now he's gonna change my air filter. We just got into the air filter. They didn't want us in there either, but looks like we got a match. This is the dirty filter that we have been breathing in my car. Just kidding, this is what the engine has been breathing. Now this little lady's getting a clean bill of health. Just like us. Okay, the oil change is done. We've got 4.4 quarts in there. She is purring and now let's start it. Well, that's all, folks. I can't thank my father-in-law, Greg, enough for his physical and mental support through these last two hours. Also, a big thank you to you for buying the oil and the filters and letting me crash the day in your outbuilding playing with cars, pretending to be the son that you never had. Ha! 